When we take a full eight hour long sleep, the body stays at a rest for a long period of time. So, and when you wake up, the body needs to move a little bit. And that's exactly what we are going to do the yoga way. So when you have woken up, you're going to sit cross-legged on the bed even before you go down. You're going to let yourself stretch nicely and that's exactly how we do it. So you take the arms up higher, you extend the arms up as up as they can get and uh, if you can see the arms with the corner of the eyes, you need to pull the arms further back, as back as they can be. There's a very gentle lift in your chin and you're going to push the arms further back till the point they cannot be seen anymore with your eyes. And then show the palms up towards the ceiling, pulling the fingers in towards the south. This is going to help you feel the stretch along the forearms. And by pushing the arms as back as they can be, you're going to draw a huge circle. And by drawing a huge circle, you're opening, you're working on the entire range of motion of your shoulders and the scapula, squeezing the muscles, those who are right between the shoulder blades behind and the upper back, the rhomboid, the trapezius, and also at the same time, opening the chest. But the trick is that you have to do this in a complete sink with your breath so half the circle you're breathing in while your arms are coming down and from here onwards your arms are going to go down and you will begin to breathe out and as you do that you would notice the way the blood is rushing towards your hands making you feel ready for the day also this is a very gentle musculoskeletal movement which is very simple and easy to remember but also it's very effective so it's going to work on the muscles it's going to work on the skeleton it's going to work on your respiratory organs spreading stretching the lungs working on the walls of the lungs internally and making the most out of the oxygen you breathe. When you breathe out, you're going to lower the arms down and relax. There's another thing you can do. You can interlace your fingers, but not right here, behind, close to the tailbone. And turning the palms away from your body, you'll be squeezing your shoulder blades in such a way that your elbows are either pointing inwards or they'll be pointing up towards the skies. Now you notice that this widens your shoulders up and also squeezes the upper back muscles. And then keeping the body flat, spine flat, you'll be bending from the base of the spine. And when you breathe out, you go forward till your forehead goes down onto the mat. And from here, you continue to push the arms over the head. Keep squeezing, breathe in, lift your chin up and slowly put the hands down onto the, onto the mat or on the bed wherever you are. So opening the shoulders, breathe in, drop the head back, and when you breathe out, you're going to bring the arms in front. So this was Ubin from Atri Yoga Studio. I'll see you next time.